Hey, 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 hey! Hope you like the music coming to you straight from your favorite Chinese restaurant. <laughs> if you did like it, leave a like. But at this point, I'm probably just begging for dislikes on this video. Eh, but whatever. Okay. What I was doing there was rolling a cigarette. Yeah, that's why I only started playing now. So, WZ131, tier 7 Chinese light tank. Um, I was complaining in chat because this was my fourth or fifth straight um, match with uh, tier 9 matchmaking and with a bad, bad map for a light tank. Like Abbey, what are you gonna do in a light tank on Abbey, especially in a low tier light tank? Well, actually, you can do quite a lot as it turned out in this game. Look at this cheeky, breaky, sneaky assassination if I can get my fat ass through there got it got him nice okay so it started started out pretty well please ignore uh, the chat <laughs> I'm just doing some complaining and explaining and yeah that's that so I'm gonna be in this position for a long time because I don't really know where to go at this point can you get a shot on the comet wow great shot got him and tracked him but now I can see his silhouette for some reason. He must be behind a rock, or no, not a rock, a fence or something. Oh, that hit. But yeah, I'm gonna stay here for a long while because, um, as I said before, I don't really know where to go here. Like, I could push the one uh, line or the eight line, but what am I gonna do against a Type 4 Heavy? You know, frontally, it's just like, nope. Because this thing doesn't have like, that much penetration. I mean, it does have great heat rounds, like 220 pen, but still not enough for like anime tanks. So I figured I'm gonna stay in the middle and try to get some sneaky, sneaky shots and do some heavies that are trying to advance on the 8 line. So uh, let's see. Okay. Oh, by the way, yeah, talking about anime tanks, the ending of this game is gonna be awkward. So if, if you like awkwardness, you should definitely either fast forward to that or just stay and wait for that, because that is going to be awkward. But enough about that right now, let's see if we can hit this T29. I already loaded the um, skill rounds because, well, T29 turret and one... 159 pen on the AP rounds, I think, or 156 somewhere, is not enough. It's enough for this guy, but I had peak loaded anyway, so yeah, I just shot him. Um, yeah, this thing doesn't have the best DPM. I mean, I don't have a rammer in it because I'm trying to like play it as a scout, as a, a damage dealer, and you all know that the view ranges of these light tanks were nerfed heavily so I'm using um, what am I using like bird stabs, ventilation and something else oh optics of course yeah okay stop digressing this IS-6 roof can be bent with the 20 hit rounds my shot I'm being pretty lucky with the accuracy right now I mean this thing is not that inaccurate but still those are kind of pixel shots, and the ISX missed me with a HE round, but yeah, RT of course won't miss because the slash radius of that thing is like, I don't know, Hiroshima bomb or something. Unfortunately, it doesn't do much damage, just, he's just annoying as RT is, like, that's what it's for. Countering fun, but okay, we got rid of these um, heavies on the 8 line, and now I'm figure it's time to move somewhere else. I mean, I don't really want to fight in this guy in the middle, because as I said, the DPM on this thing is not very good, but it is an amazingly fun little thing, though. So I'm just like roaming about, don't know really which way to go, can't really decide. Um, and Oh yeah, and by the way, if you don't think I got spotted there, um, I definitely did get spotted. I, because the RT kind of missed me and still did damage, but I don't, I still don't have six cents. Well, I didn't at that point yesterday uh, in this tank. I was just trying to grind through it so I could buy the tier 8 before the top of the tree ends. So, 
Yeah, so no six sense. The crew is a hundred percent though, but it's kind of awkward to play a left tank with no six sense. So I figured I'm gonna go and try and help this Oni, but then this Oni decides to die. So yeah, um, I won't have any of that. Like I'm not fighting Oho and a super Persian frontally, at least not yet. But, and also I only have one heat bomb, so. Yeah, that that wouldn't be a good idea to go and try and fight them frontally. So here I'm, like, I decided to go back, but I was thinking, like, what am I gonna do back there, really? I could just go to my previous position, or go frontally push a Type 4 Heavy on the, like, 8 lane, so... Uh, I decided to make an ambush here, if something decides to cross the middle, because we don't really have anything back in base to defend it. And also just wait for the old hole and the super purging to advance and try and ambush them together with the Emil. So yeah, I thought that was my best best option and it turned out well, as you'll see pretty well actually. Uh, so yeah, I'm just waiting. Like scratching my balls and I don't know what I'm doing here, thinking about life and the existence and why are we here. Dynamic gameplay, camping bush, and I see the Oho, he fired, and there's the 1390, so on the move, heat round, my last heat round for that 1390. So now there's this Oho, gonna side hug him of course, and just troll him, just troll the guy, he misses me, and yeah, that felt amazing while playing it. Some Japanese fireworks, and now there's this super pushing here. He has no chance, I mean, I got the speed. He's just too clumsy to really... I'm, I'm gonna take a shot here, but... Yeah, that's... At least he got a one shot off. But this is over. There goes the super pushing. Nice thank you bot there, friend. Your 7 light can't do anything against me. I'm trying to go into Arty Shadow, because they do have one Arty, and Arty loves to shoot at light tanks. So I'm waiting, waiting, and yeah. There is no Arty Shadow, comrade. Arty Shadow doesn't exist in this game. Oh yeah, but it wasn't it wasn't too bad, it's like 100 damage or so. Could have been much worse, could have penned me and ended my fun right there, so... Okay, I'm trying to reposition to their base, but I plan to do some sniping, and yeah, who put this tank here, man? Like, who put that there? What the hell? We didn't see that. <laughs> Alright, what can we do here? They still have an ISU, a Type 4 Heavy, and the Clicker. Now, as I remember, the Type 4 Heavy is still on full HP, the ISU is pretty close to full HP, and the Clicker well, is just the Clicker. Filthy bastard clicking on people. Okay, but let's see what we can see. My view range is not optimal here, as you can see, because yeah, they nerfed tier 7 light tanks and then they get like super tier 9 matchmaker all the time. So I only track the ISU. I don't think my penetration values are like enough to go through that reliably. I mean, you can go through that, but it depends on the accuracy. If you hit the mantlet or the tracks. We're just not gonna hit. I think one of those two um, line shots actually hits, so nice result there. And just stay here and wait for something to be spotted. I mean, I know I'm a light tank, but I'm just a filthy scrub. <laughs> I'm leaving that tier 8 light tank to do the job for me. And I'm just sniping, see if I can get some shots. And the light tank is scouting. I mean, the other light tank is scouting, so yeah. Can I get some shots? He spots the RT, and I miss the RT, of course, and our light tank plays for it. Just before I get the RT, the RT gets our other light tank, and he's not happy about that. Just look at the chat. <laughs> but okay, two tanks left. I mean, they can still easily win this, because the ISU can one-shot all of us, and so can the Type 4, especially if he's using premium um, HE rounds, so yeah, we still have to be careful, but the ISU dies, and uh, if it worked before, it's gonna work again, right? 
on a Japanese tank, so let's side hug this guy. And remember when I told you it's gonna get awkward? Well, it's time to get awkward, because I can't even... I mean, I pen those two shots with auto-aim, but I still can't reliably pen this guy's sides. Like, I'm trying to aim above the tracks, but it's just not happening for me. Like, I'm maybe too close to him. And my gun can elevate as high, so but it's just awkward. Like, and I my play isn't like making it any better. It just I don't really know. Should I track him? Should I not track him? And I'm tracking him here, but he's gonna repair. Uh, yeah, just trying to pan him, but just not happening. Like, what the hell? Why am I in the same game with this guy? Like. What am I supposed? If I was alone, what was I supposed to do? I could just load full heat clip, and that's it. But it doesn't matter. We won the game, pretty good result, and let's see what we came up with. All right, so ma mastery, Orlix Metal, high caliber, and a top gun in a tier nine match on heavy with a light tank. I think that's a pretty good result. Almost 4k damage, six kills, and over 1600 base experience. So yeah, this this was actually my best game when I played this tank. I unlocked and bought with the tier 8. I even made some money and you see I had boosters on, so it's almost 5k experience for this game. Uh, and kind of a lot of my shots actually bent, like considering what was I shooting at. Mostly Japanese enemy tanks and heavy tanks and stuff. But no, no damage to my assistants, because yeah, light tanks. <laughs> well, thanks for watching and... Bye.